Just, just take me through your mindset as you go through some of the early just, just teams and stay confident. Oh yeah, most definitely. Just seeing that, uh, that first Larry, uh, if I would have just jumped higher, uh, got to the point if I reacted on time, I would have been able to make that catch a little sooner. Uh, he expects me to come down with those, even though if it's a bad ball or not, he expects me to come down with those, and I got to come down with that. And then, man, I, I, got, I got a little too excited because that would have been a big game. And then especially after that uh, yeah, post ball, he's, he's huge, 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 uh, got through, beat him over top, and then trying to come back for that ball, I got to make it so uh, my quarterback doesn't take the INT. Got to be better on that part. Got to be a better all around, honestly. Is that part of the game plan going on? Just a lot of respect for Oh, no. That was not part of the game plan. Uh, I wish it was part of the game plan. <laughs> Uh, honestly, uh, just being in the position to make plays and I have to go ahead and ca uh, capitalize on those opportunities. And for, as you see tonight, I capitalized on some of the opportunities. If I capitalized on all, all of them, I would have been over 100. So we got to go back to the drawing board, go back to working, uh, get some of the minor errors out, and focus on next week with UCLA. And I can't wait for UCLA. Uh, it must have been tough for you to see Travis go down the way he did because it was really light for the team, and it was so quiet in the league. You can see him, too. Yeah, most definitely. Just seeing how Travis developed over time and then knowing him since uh, I was at Colorado, went up there, we was going back and forth trying to see who would get more yards uh, that Colorado versus Oregon game last year. And, like, he's a dog. He's a pure dog, and I – Hope for I uh, bless his heart. Hopefully, God goes ahead and blesses him on a speedy recovery. And just seeing that him go down, you can see the energy in the team and how we just want to go on and finish out that game for him. And we did just that. I don't think it really is sideline because you know, that's me having a smart guy, guys that play a lot of football. So, you know, it, it definitely made something. It, it clicked. It started to click for me because honestly, the confidence is key. Uh, I needed confidence this whole year, and you can see like I lack confidence. And for me to go out there and make that catch, it was it was definitely yeah, helping me increase what I already had and go out there and make you know, the rest of the catch. Well. And I think we just need to step up and make some adjustments play-wise. We saw some looks that we had on the um, same team, like I was saying earlier. And We've been trying to practice consistency. I mean, like, shoot, you got to see us in practice. Man, <laughs> we, we could be the best practice players ever. Shoot, I was doing amazing in practice, but come out here in these games and I'm doing so shitty. Uh, it's just about consistency, uh, staying even, never get too high, never get too low. I think just, just the effort truly energy, trying to start uh, stay balanced up, out, and, and like from said, that you can go on and win games and be consistent the throughout the whole game. And, and from that you can really see how, how the and offense and will really sure correlate with each other, and everybody can bounce and feed off each other. Oh yeah, we had a conversation. No comment on the conversation. We got a little chirpy back and forth. Oh, shoot. Yeah, I mean, I mean Jordan, man. When you see then, such a great player just like that, and you see the abilities he can just do, I try to pick and uh, choose what I can take from this game. Wish I could take that 23 miles per hour speed. I'm close, but I'm not that close, man. He be sliding. But, yeah, just like seeing how he just develops as a player and how he always keeps his calm, it's definitely something to take away from his game and add it to mind. You might have already answered this, but was it nice having you know, a touchdown against your old team tonight? Oh, most definitely. Most definitely, but the thing is, though, it's just another team out there. I worried about the one we have right here, yeah, and I'm thankful you know, for the beyond the one we have right here. And, uh, you know, you know, what makes that special to you? Uh, just being. This is my first year being a part of it. I'm one and one against UCLA. The last time they beat us, I was very mad. Um, just coming, just coming into this game. This crosstown rivalry, it means everything to this team. It means everything to this this community, this tradition, everything. So just going ahead and going into this game week, you can really just see how we're going to pick up the intensity. We're, we've got to make sure everybody's locked in. We've got another 24 hours to go ahead and prepare, and we got to be on point this game.